This National RTAP in the Cloud training tutorial for GTFS Builder looks at the data elements for calendar and calendar dates in our Import-Export Workbook. I've opened our Import-Export Workbook for the Notes tab and Calendar in the two shades of blue and calendar dates are the data elements we're going to work on. For example, the Saturday trip sample that we've been looking at includes a 1 for yes we operate on Saturday and 0 for all the other days of the week. The Monday through Friday have 1 assigned to Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and zeros for the weekend. There's a start date and an end date. If we have a school tripper that begins at the date after Labor Day and ends next June, we would assign a start and end date to that service. For the calendar date, which allow you to have exceptions or holidays, Memorial Day, July 4th, Labor Day, Thanksgiving, Christmas, etc., we have the exception type 2 to remove that service. We're doing what we can to make it easier for you. At your dashboard, at your related links, you can go to a calendar dates selection where we have taken a series of known federal holidays and assign them the proper date and show you what day of the week it will be. So, for example, if none of these fall on a Saturday, and certainly Christmas and other dates can be on Saturday, but the federal holiday may not be observed on that day, if none of these dates are on a Saturday, when we go back to our Excel file, we don't need to exclude, with exception type 2, any holiday that doesn't apply to that service ID. We do encourage you to fill out your exceptions. Uh, it will be tested as a qualifier, even though in our specifications it's considered optional. When you have a service ID that might be added to your data because you're offering Sunday service for the day after Thanksgiving, for example, you could see in here that you would remove all of your weekday service and add that Sunday service for that holiday, that day after Thanksgiving holiday. This concludes the details for GTFS Builder when looking at calendar and calendar dates for Step 3.